Welcome back guys to my next episode of my Minecraft beta let's play. Uh, this is actually recording, uh, or this is actually being recorded a few minutes after the initial uh, episode, mainly because I just want to play this game so bad. And uh, yeah, I wasn't just going to leave and come back after a few days of not playing. So um, for you guys, it might be like a day or two between uploads, but for me, it's only been like 10 minutes. Um, and... Like I was talking about in the first episode, uh, the whole point of this is to not really have a structure or like a set of objectives to complete. I just want to play the game. Back when I first got hooked on the game, but because this is the version that I, you know, that got me, or the first version that I played on Minecraft. So, with that being said, I'm gonna go into these videos with no objective at all. <laughs> um, I'm just gonna hit record and just go whatever the world takes me. And I know in the last episode I said I was going to either explore a bit or do cave exploration, but I think I'm going to actually explore a bit, collect some resources like trees and stuff, uh, get some more food sources because you can't really make farms, uh, there's no breeding of any kind, um, well, I'm pretty sure there isn't any like sort of breeding, so there's no point of keeping these pigs alive uh, because I can't breed them, breed them with wheat. Uh, so I just gotta kill as many of them as I can, and I think the most valuable food source in this version is going to be, uh, bread, because bread is, obviously, you can, is a crop, and you can, obviously, grow bread, so, I think I wanna definitely, definitely get, get uh, make a wheat farm, and either this episode or the next episode, maybe the next episode, actually, maybe the next episode, I know I just said I wasn't gonna structure the videos, but it's so like I still have to do essentials like make a house and you know do all that crazy stuff So I'm pretty sure next episode we might make a, a little house Just so I can establish things like a uh, like a farm or whatever It's like a, a, a base really that's what we need every Minecraft world needs a base and one th thing I hate about this version is that food isn't stackable so now I have all these raw pork chops just in my inventory for no reason. Um, and I'm actually surrounded by these mountains. So let me try and... Oop, I hear a, hear a zombie or a skeleton. I hear a skeleton. Um, yeah, let me see if I can find an ele elevation. And I see clouds, so we're definitely at a pretty high elevation. But I want to like have like a vista to be able to look onto the world. And uh, see what I can do. To see the world around me. Get inspired by the terrain. And look at that. You See, this is the, the terrain generation I was talking about in the last episode. You don't find stuff like this. Uh, maybe, maybe like, uh, rare occasions you would find, like, like these type of terrain. And, um, like, newer version of Minecraft. And also, I realized that I didn't really do much in the last episode. Like, it's a 20-something minute long episode, but I really didn't accomplish much. And actually, I'm kind of uh, happy with it. Because this is also supposed to be revisiting, uh, you know, old school Minecraft. And back then, honestly, when I first started playing Minecraft, I had no idea what I was doing. So progression was sort of sort of slow and stuff and I was just like learning the game or whatever. So I'm actually kind of not really like uh disappointed with how the last episode accomplished really nothing at all. Um cuz it kind of just takes me back, you know, like that was my first night. You know, was not having uh really much to accomplish. It was just survive the first night. Um so yeah. We'll see if I can accomplish a bit more though. Um, so we're gonna head to the desert, collect some cactus and stuff like that. There's no desert villages, there's none of that, no structures or whatever, desert temples. I think the only structures that exist in this version are uh, dungeons. Yeah, dungeons. Oh, we might actually see a dungeon in the sand. Cause I know that those were pretty common uh, back then. It's like you just like walk in like a desert and just see like a, a huge like hole with a bunch of sand like 
covered the dungeon. So we might see some of that. <clears throat> but yeah, just basking in on the old style of Minecraft. Um, if this was the new version of Minecraft, I'd probably already be settled down, have a bunch of uh, resources, and be caving, but... I like I like the idea of just kicking back and uh, taking my time with it. Um, you know, I have no idea where this uh, specific series is going to take me. Whether it takes me ten episodes or it takes me a hundred, who knows? Um, just whenever I feel like I want to move on, I guess I'll move on. Collect some coal here, and also last I remember I said I was gonna give some shout outs last episode. Um, and I only gave one shout out to uh, Pixel Rift, but there's another person that just that inspired me to uh, to play Minecraft, Minecraft again, and that's I, I forgot his name, I actually forgot his name, but uh, it's the person who recently died after five years of uh, hardcore mode. I actually forgot his name, but you can look it up. It's it's a video. Um, I might actually play it like right now. I knew it. No! Really? That's how I die? Oh my god! I'm fucking stupid. I'm fucking stupid. Or something? I don't know. We'll see. We'll see uh, if there's a video uh, in between that or not. But yeah, he played uh, Minecraft Hardcore for five years. And I'll say Minecraft Hardcore, if you die once, that's it. Game over, your world is done. But he has died on that world for five years. And he's done. I saw the montage of it too. And he actually did so much on that world. that It's, just, it's actually insane. That, that level of progression on a Hardcore world. And it's just got me like wanting to make a world like not like to that extent but to to grind a world out again and have everything of it like in it you know so not obviously not, not gonna do that in this version because it's um even though this is like an endless possibility uh really can't um eventually we'll get to the point where i'm just uh making um what should we call it making world or just making buildings just to make buildings and i'm not really much of a builder um because it's i mean there's somewhat of automatic farms in this version but it's like that's eh, not the best but i could just make some cool like designs or whatever i don't know we'll see we'll see where the, uh, this series takes me but um yeah this terrain is there's no sprinting either so that's kind of annoying to be having to walk back and forth but also, there's no hunger, so I don't have to worry about going hungry or and constantly eating. Um, but yeah, it's getting dark again. Day two has fallen. Uh, I don't know. It's the time. I feel like the day is going by really fast. I feel like I have no time to really do much. Um, but uh, yeah, this terrain is looking pretty nice. I really don't know if I'm going to do much on this world, though. Um, like I said, I don't know how long I want this series to, to go on for, but there's a lot of, uh, of nice terrain. Um, you know, especially like right over there. Seems some nice terrain. And stuff like that. And I want to get back to my base before it gets dark. Because obviously in the last episode, when nighttime hit, it was super, super dark. Um, so creeper spawn right there, and I think it's over here where my base is. I don't want to fall because I won't be able to regen. Um, and I don't want to waste for all the pork chops. I want to be able to cook my food. But yeah, this is <laughs> what well, it feels like to travel back in time. Um, and I'm probably gonna die, seeing that I can't really see where I'm going, and. It's really dark, and mobs are going to spawn like crazy. Like right there, skeletons are spawning there, and, I, and now I, can, I literally can't see in front of me. And if I light a torch, like look at how little the torch lights. That's actually kind of crazy. Um, 
just put some torches down just to be able to see a bit or for you guys to see a bit um pretty sure it's over here i gotta get to like the coastline like right over there ish maybe Uh, I hear a zombie. Ooh, oh, okay. He came up from behind. Um. Damn, it, it is really, really dark. Nah, I don't remember this. Actually, is this my spawn point? I feel like this is where I spawn. So if I spawn over here. Oh my god, that's two creepers. Oh my goodness. That is not what I want. Okay. Um, okay, I, I can see the torches. Um, no, my spawn probe was over there because I remember I'm crossing this. Okay, so. That's nighttime. I'm gonna make sure not to travel too much at nighttime because I literally cannot see. And if I can't see, then clearly you guys won't be. I mean, it would probably be better after like video editing, you know, making it brighter for you guys. And what is that jump? I don't do spiders even jump like that anymore. That actually threw me off track. Um, yeah, let's light some of this up. I don't want to waste too much torches though because. Like, look, oh my, he, like, he's getting high. I don't know, I feel, I feel like spiders don't do that anymore. I feel like they're just linear and just go straight towards the player. I have a lot of trees blocking this, too. Oh, did not mean to fall. Ah, back when I can just swing my sword and not have to worry about cooldowns. Okay, uh, let's... Definitely cook some of this food. And let's place some of this. Uh, we have we have a bed. We can actually sleep through the night. But I don't want to do that yet. Um, I'll set my spawn board uh, some other time. But for now, I don't want to do any of that. And also, zombies drop feathers. They don't drop brown and flesh. I think brown and flesh change came out. Um, uh, came out in 1.8. 1.8 saw a lot of big changes, uh, which is the version after this. And then they went to Minecraft 1.9, but 1.9 never, oh, what am I doing? 1.9 never officially released. It was, uh, um, it was just always in like pre-release and then they just said, screw it, we're going to go to Minecraft 1.0 and officially release the game. But, uh, let me eat some pork chop, replenish my health. Actually, oh, what the... Oh. Okay. Uh, my thing glitched. Okay. So actually, I'm gonna make an iron chest plate because I wanna have protection. Um, and then an iron sword. Is that what I wanna make? I think I'm actually hold on to the iron here and just get some more. Um, so yeah, alright, let's, uh, let's try our best, actually, let's light up the area <laughs> first, oh, 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 crap, ah, uh, back when skeletons have no idea how to shoot because of the bow mechanics, you weren't able to draw back your bow, so, Okay, I was gonna go explore the cave, but I am not in a good position to do that. Wow. Alright, my okay. Wow. Oh, also, I don't need that. So I'm pretty sure if I right click this, is it? Yep. If it eats, oh my god. So I can waste food like that, which I don't want to do, obviously. Um, okay, bring out the skeleton, uh, let me just kill him, 
Yeah, so uh, 1.8 also included the uh, the drawback of bows. So I was in a. Oh my goodness! It's like, like th th these spiders have leaps. Uh, but yeah, like bows in this version, are, you can just shoot like a like a mini gun or a machine gun, and do some damage. Uh, so the cage right here. We're gonna explore more of it. Um, definitely want to get some more. Definitely need to get some more iron. Uh, that'd be. Oh, speaking of iron, we have some more iron right here. So we have two at home. We, we can make a pick and we can make a sword. Or I should save and just make a pick and make a. Uh, make some pants. Um, definitely want to make some pants. Oh! Oh, wow, that was honestly unexpected. <laughs> wow, I honestly did not expect to find a dungeon. <laughs> what the heck? Okay, um, wow. Okay, <laughs> that was honestly like the weirdest thing and we have a dungeon now, a zombie dungeon. As I was just mentioning it too, like this is like what dungeons are like the only like thing that generates in this world in terms of like structures. Um, so yeah, we have a zombie dungeon. I don't know what I'm gonna do with it because uh, there's no XP. So there's some XP farms uh, in this version of Minecraft and I really don't need feathers. I really don't need feathers but it'll be a nice project to do so maybe not anytime soon but maybe like 10 episodes in i'll uh i'll make a uh a nice uh zombie farm i guess get some feathers that's definitely what i need right now is feathers um, it's, this cave is really dark. There has to be an option to turn this up, right? Yeah, there's literally no option to turn up the uh, brightness. It's just naturally dark. Some more iron. Ooh, lava. Lava looks a bit different, too. Okay, let's get some iron here. And there's a lot of coal. I might collect some of this coal off camera because I don't want to spend too much time just mining away. Um, let me explore some of this cave a bit though. See if we're going to find some more iron. Because that's definitely what I need. Um, backtrack a bit. See if I miss any iron. Just chilling. I think iron. Yep, right here. Miss some iron. I think iron might be the... Uh, the main resource I want in this version. Cause uh obviously you can survive off of iron, and iron's a lot easier to get in my opinion in like newer Minecraft. Or is it really new like or just like present Minecraft today might or whatever. Uh iron's really to get and easy to obtain and you can make iron farms and stuff. And an iron what you an iron uh I'm trying to say, Iron Armor can take you like basically the end game, really. Like you can beat the dragon with just Iron Armor. Pretty sure, pretty sure you can beat the Wither with Iron too. But you just have to be more careful with the Wither. But uh, maybe not Iron Tools, but Iron Armor for sure. And in this version, uh, your armor, the armor system in early Minecraft was really not that good uh oh crap oh 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 wow, you can burn oh that was actually kind of close took me, took me a bit of a bit of damage but yeah, our system wasn't the best. It really wasn't. K 
Okay. Ah, oh, it's gonna blow. Okay, uh, so we have a lot of iron and a lot of coal, <laughs> so maybe I was wrong, maybe I didn't, I didn't remember it correctly, but it's, it seems like, it seems like iron and coal is still easy to obtain, or it doesn't take much. I just wish that the, <laughs> the brightness was a lot better, because it's really, really dark. I'm, I know I said that like a million times already, but it's <laughs> like surprisingly dark. Um, my screen is really bright to begin with, so, the fact that it's even dark, kind of crazy. Let's collect some of this iron. Um, so I think this is going to wrap up the video. Uh, we found a dungeon, we explored the cave, we explored a bit of the terrain as well. Uh, a lot of, lot of fucking terrain too. Alright, sorry for the random cut, but um, like I was saying, lots of terrain, we explored, we found a dungeon, we found the resources. So, I honestly think, with that, I'm gonna leave it off here. Um, and there's a lot of resources, a lot of resources that I need to collect, and I might do that off camera, because I don't, I don't really wanna... ...do it, or just like, just sit here and just... Okay. See, like, maybe stuff like this, obviously, I want to be on camera in case I die or something happens. I mean, obviously, this is action. Uh, me finding these mobs. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Oh, wow. Um. But I don't want to just, like, mine away, uh, for the entire video. But, uh, we have some coal. I think I'm just gonna... Head back, ooh. Okay. Yeah. I think we're just gonna head back to the base. But I'm gonna leave it off here. Hope you guys enjoyed, and hope you guys enjoyed the series. And this is more to come with this uh, Let's Play. Um, I'm actually enjoying Minecraft for what it was back in the day. Just uh, that nostalgia feel, really. And this is just a great game. It really is. Uh, revisiting it, this version after eight years. And it's still a fun game, even presently. But I hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Take care, and adios.